Hello, it's midwinter. I'm in the fruit garden and it's time to prune all of the fruit in here. First on my list is the bush fruit, in this case, black currants. As you can see from these new shoots down here, black currants sprout from the base all the time. So every stem that you take out, you take out right down to the ground. Now the first on my list of stems to prune out is anything that's dead or diseased. Now these two are actually quite young, healthy bushes, so I'm lucky enough not to be able to find any on here. But that's the first thing you would take out. Second on your list is anything that's crossing over because that can actually cause quite a lot of damage to the bark. Here we have a stem, as you can see, it's crossing over its neighbour. Simply take it out right at the bottom and remove it. A few more over here. You're just looking for stems which are nicely spaced within the bush, all free to move and grow. The next thing I'm going to do is take out any branches that are growing into the centre of the bush. That's because what you're aiming for is a nice open goblet shape with plenty of air circulating in the middle of the bush so that fungal diseases can't take a hold. Any branches like this one, as you can see, coming up right from the middle of the bush, congesting all this area in the centre here, so take it right out. And then in the other bush, there's this one here. As you can see, growing right up through the middle of the bush, so take it out at the base. These bushes are only two years old, so they're relatively young by blackcurrant standards. For older bushes though, you'd also take out any really old branches, anything more than about three years old, because blackcurrants fruit best on wood that's two to three years old. So you want to leave the younger stuff in because that's going to become your fruiting wood next year. Leave the two to three year old stuff in because that's going to be the most productive, but remove all of your wood that's four years old or older, of course. Now, it's easy to tell the difference between older wood and younger wood because this is two year old wood here. As you can see, it's starting to discolor a little bit on the surface, it's a bit textured. By contrast, newer wood, like this one here, is coppery and rather smooth. Very easy to tell the difference. There's just one last job to do before you've finished. Give the whole thing a nice feed. I'm using a slow-release pelleted poultry manure here, about a handful per bush, scattered around the bottom, and then mulch over the top. That's all you need to do from now until you're picking those lovely, fat, luscious black currants later in the summer.